I have been praying and the Lord has never answered my prayers. Oh, so the problem was that this man, he was committed to the church events and affairs and giving tithes and offering so that the Lord may answer his prayers. You are leading without followers. You are just taking a walk. And this walk, you are either moving fast or you are going slow. A journey that you find somebody moving fast. It's because uh, he's going nowhere. And uh, I want to testify that I, I, I did not be for his white writings. Errors could could engulf God's church and many people could be misled from the truth. Now before I discuss what to expect still with regards to, to the, the effect of the youth and society as parents as a community unless you take your stand and decide how you're going to raise these children the government will step in and the government does not consider morals the government does not consider what the bible says they will just take a stand and this reflects in some of the decisions that are being made in, with regards to the content um, children are exposed to in the name of sexual and reproductive health that will understand where we are going it is through reading that nations are kept informed it was through reading that Israel was kept informed even in the wilderness as Moses read the Ten Commandments before the children of Israel. Parents, let's wake up. It's not a generation we are bringing up. No. It's not their mistake. It is we training them. They don't know even how to spread their beds. Somebody wakes up, throws a blanket. Then at night you hear, Nani amechukua blanket yangu. Who has taken away my blanket? The blanket is under the bed. 